Hello students, here we are going to learn about energy awareness in optical networking. So energy consumption can become the bottleneck for high speed data communication in today's network. So efficient routing scheme and resource allocations both in optical and electrical domain can be used to help match get this problem. So in this case of scenario, uh, the energy resources or allocation in terms of uh, devices like uh, a router or like in switches and so any other also devices for the communicating between them. So they provide uh, using uh, some energy consumption or um, some awareness uh, about the energies uh, required by the different devices in this particular network. So a transparent IP over wavelength division multiplexing network can be utilized to allow traffic to optically bypass the electronic component such as IP router or switch is network switch which typically consume more power than corresponding e optical equipment in the optical network so uh, really in the case of the ip router they are utilized to transmit a data in the form of electronic signals so they have to uh, use a somewhat uh, higher comparison of energy compared the optical equipment uh, so they require some more power so for that uh, some network are there combined with the this kind of mechanism both optical and electronic so at that time uh, energy awareness scenario is very very much important uh, in the case of the uh, networking for the oil networks for many type of application in the optical grid networks the user may not care exactly where their job is being processed uh, for the scenario like that uh, you have to transmit data to a particular uh, network so the multi layer or multi hierarchy level network is there so they provide different features so according to their you have to define a, a various job for performing the different tasks for the different layer also so this allows the routing algorithm the flexibility of choosing a suitable processing or particular the destination node for a given task so such that the network resources can be utilized as efficiently as this is possible so this is known as a principle of any cast routing so in this case the particular destination node is there uh, so for that uh, particular algorithm is required uh, to processing all this kind of data or finding the perfect route for that particular node in the optical net so in this case uh, energy consumption rather than the cost of component equipment may eventually become the barrier to continue the growth for today's core or transport networks in the optical domain. So some of components are connected in this medium, they require somewhat higher energy to transmit the particular data. Some of components are uh, parallel with the particular the grid network, they require the small, uh, some of the less energy. So for that, the energy awareness is essentially to uh, transmit the data in the optical networking. So consequently, the energy efficiency of core wavelength division multiplexing or particular the core network using a WDM network has received a significant innovation in the last few years. So for that reason, they have to implement some larger part to provide data for the larger uh, wavelength or larger light part the data. So in this case, energy scenario is there to transmit a particular data. So for that, the after DDM, WDM network is there for uh, also dense DWDM uh, net network is available in the optical network for the better efficiency or less power requirement or less energy requirement to transmit the data particular the node or destination node or the particular network. So a number of technique for the energy efficient resource allocation with unicast routing in the WDM optical network have been reported and the literature wise. So they also provide some scenario to provide uh, energy consumption and energy awareness things. So you uh, using this kind of mechanism, you have to transmit the more number of data uh, using a less uh, power consumptions. So more recently, 
energy aware approach uh, in case of both heuristics and optimal formulations using any cast routing has been considered so they provide very good features for that optical network so the goal is to find route uh, in the topology in such a way that it, uh, it reduces the overall power consumption so the optimal path based uh, processing also been initiated uh, for the data to transmit the particular node or a particular source to destination and they use the less uh, distance power or less base configuration base minimization so they also provide all our performance in the case of the power consumption so by switching off unused network element so some of the network elements uh, they are the providing uh, not uh, any good path to the particular node so you have to use unnecessary net on use unnecessary network so using this kind of mechanism energy consumption and energy awareness principle is uh, implemented in the optical networking